Hey boo, it's Chanel and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to use three different hairstyles inspired by Queen Selena Quintanilla. So, if you don't know who Selena is, she was a Mexican-American Texan, Go Texas, Grammy-winning singer, songwriter, model, actress, and fashion designer. She is known as the Queen of Tejana Music because she entered a male-dominated industry and took over. She is one of the most celebrated Mexican-American entertainers and she is an icon for many women and has inspired millions. But sadly, when she was 23 years old, she was shot and killed by her fan club president, Yolanda Salavar in Corpus Christi on March 31st, 1995. Even though she passed away, her legacy still rings until this day and has one of the biggest influences in my life. So, let's get into the tutorial. Hard wave brush, edge brush, rat tail comb, hairspray, edge control, bobby pins, and a hair bun. To begin this hairstyle, you need to create a part behind your ear. This part is going to go from ear to ear, creating two sections in your hair. Then with the front section, you're going to slick your hair with gel and your brush until it's sleek. Now that you're done slicking your hair, you're going to get a ponytail and wrap your hair around it until it's secure. To cover the ponytail, I'm going to get a piece of my hair from my ponytail and wrap it around the ponytail. To make sure it stays in place, I'm going to secure it with a bobby pin. Now with my edge brush, I'm going to lay my edges with some gel. Finished, I'm spraying my hair with hairspray. There you go, now you're finished. To begin this hairstyle, you're going to start by side parting your hair. Then you're going to create a medium sized triangle part in your hair. To separate the section of hair, I am now twisting it. Now, with my rat tail comb, I am redefining my part. Now that I am done parting my hair, I'm going to put the rest into a ponytail. Then with some gel and my wave brush, I'm going to stick my hair into a perfect ponytail. Finally, after brushing my hair to the max, I am now securing it with a ponytail. To create the fake bang, I am going to swoop and stick my hair down with my wave brush. Now with my edge brush, I am creating more of a swoop effect. Now with some bobby pins, I'm going to pin my hair to the back of my head. Now with the remaining amount of hair, I'm just going to wrap it around the ponytail because when we create the bun, it's going to hide it. To prepare my hair for the bun, I am brushing on my hair to make the texture less curly. To do that, I'm just gelling it with edge control and spraying it with hairspray. Now I am wrapping my hair on the ponytail in a circular motion. Now I am using bobby pins to secure my hair and for the pieces that are sticking out I'm just going to tuck them back in the bun. Once again with the edge brush I'm just sticking down my fake bang. 
So I wanted to be just like her in the picture, so I got some silver hoop earrings. And now you're finished. To begin this hairstyle, you want to put your hair into a high ponytail. To get the perfect ponytail, I like to flip my hair upside down and form a ponytail. But before I secure it, I like to slick my hair down with gel and a wave brush. Now I'm wrapping my hair around the ponytail. Now with my sock bun, I'm going to slide my hair into the middle of it. Now that my hair is inside the hair bun, I am getting a medium sized piece of hair and teasing it. Teasing your hair is when you comb your hair backwards to create volume. The trickiest part about this hairstyle is trying to create the oval looking thing, I don't know what to call it. But what I did to create it was I wrapped my hair around my thumb and then pinned the hair under my bun. So basically, I'm going to keep on doing this to different sections of hair until I create the first layer. So to make the second layer, you're going to follow the first few steps just by teasing your hair and then wrapping it, but you're just going to depend it on the first layer if that makes any sense. <laughs> So my camera died while I was recording this, but basically you're just doing the same steps over and over till there's no hair left. Now that I've finished my hair, I'm just spraying it with hairspray and making sure that the back of my hair is smooth 
in my wave brush. So to be just like her, I'm gonna do the little laid curl thing on the forehead. Using my edge brush, I'm just pulling a piece of my hair from the front and then laying the piece of hair with edge control. And then with the little comb, I'm using it to create a little circular part. After spraying it, you're done. Okay, that's the end of the video. Bye, Will.